Well, welcome back to a Cookie Corner of YouTube. I haven't been away that long. <laughs> but here is this month's scroller box. Yes. So this arrived literally a second ago and I thought I'd jump on and open the box. Open the box. <laughs> I'm just going to take you up a little further. So the first thing I'm going to do is to rip open the back. So I'm just going to turn it over, try and obfuscate my address label on the back there and we're in oh i'm so excited aren't you excited <laughs> so uh, let's open up so we've got the lovely scroller box for anybody who's not in the know scroller box is a monthly art subscription box uh, it's mystery box so you never know what you're going to get until the box arrives on your doormat uh, which is quite fun because there are some things in here you might have seen before there's some things in here you've never seen before and um, it's nice to try new stuff so maybe you're stuck in your ways and you want to try something different or you just like a lot of variety in your art supplies as I do Squall box is a great way to go um, I will leave a link down into the description box and I think you will get a 10% off if you use that particular code. So, um, yeah, let's crack open the supplies. Shall we take it out of the box? Let's take it out of the box. Oh, okay. Beautiful box. I do love the inners of these boxes. You've got the scroller challenge. Share your unboxings with us. Scroller box there. Scroller challenge, create something with only the items inside this box. I always include the box and any packing materials as well, because, you know. And every box sold will paint pa pa pant one tree. I think that should say plant one tree in association with trees for the future. <laughs> Not pant a tree. Although I've often been found panting under trees, especially I've been on a long yomp through the, uh, the woods around here. Right, okay. Ooh, 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 this looks exciting. <laughs> Love that cover. Can't look at it yet though. The artwork. Ooh. The artwork is dust, 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 dust. I'll go with that. We'll have a look at that later. Substrates looking interesting. <gasps> toned paper <laughs> okay i've got an idea let's have a look inside i'm well aware that i haven't done the challenge from last time yet <clears throat> i will get on that Ooh. okay okay this is definitely pointing me towards the things i'm thinking of I have been wanting to get some more of these. So this is a kneadable art array razor by Faber-Castell. I love these. So that's a win for me because I want to get a few more of those. But one will keep me going for a while. This looks like an applicator of some kind to do with pastels. And yes, it's looking like soft pastel day. Ooh, sweetie. Strawberry flavoured. Nice. Okay, sticker matches the artwork. Soft pastels, yes. Now, this is something I want to get into in 2024 a little bit more of. I have got quite a few nice soft pastels. This looks like um, 24 mini. Oh, how cool is this? Wow. Oh, blimey, look at all those colours. <laughs> And a bit, I went a bit Mary Poppins there, didn't I? <laughs> That's so cool. And then there's a little leaflet in there about the soft pastels as well. I'm going to pop that back on there. And then slide that back in there. Ooh, very exciting. Very exciting. I've got one of these already, but it's perfect. That's a titanium white Derwent pastel pencil. Uh, it's P720 if you were interested. So P720. And another one of these beauties, which I'm always happy to have. It's a Gold Faber, Faber Castell 2B pencil. 2B is my favourite kind of drawing pencil. So we'll get rid of the tissue paper. We've got this. 
this is awesome so we've got some toned paper i'll have to find out more about this in the description in the description in the magazine mm. <laughs> okay so the artwork i like to find where the sticker comes from it's like a little puzzle for me to find where it comes from <laughs> ah, i've seen it it's there and there yeah just there <laughs> uh hand drawings mm, interesting this is i love all the use of color as well this this grips me so lots of details about the artist there i'll hold it up if you want to have a little look there are their socials at the bottom there very cool okay so let's have a look in the scroll zine pop these over to one side let's have a look Excuse my uh, little moosey Christmas mat. <laughs> oh, mini but mighty. 24 pastels that pack a punch of pigment with each swipe. Look at all the colours. I love this. I'm loving this so far. Absolutely loving it. Oh, yeah. Excited. Cool. Colour me excited. <laughs> A uh, pad of textured and slightly toned paper offers a perfect pastel surface. Lovely. So that front bit must be the cover, but I'd be I'd still use that. I'd still use that. That is nice. Very nice. Um, kneadable eraser, the artist print, the sketchy, sketchy, sketchy 2B, which is my favourite. The Derwent Pastel White for highlights. Although there is a white in there as well. A soft sponge to help you blend. These are perfect. I also have got some from the pan pastels, the little pan pastel tool that will probably work as well. But I'm only going to use things from the box. So the sticker and the little sweetie treaty. Lovely. Okay. There's a little QR code there that you can um, pull up on your phone. So that you can check the prices of each of the items that you've been sent so we've got a little sit down interview with the artist i love this artist's work this is awesome just look at the colors absolutely love it really cool that's going to be a sit down and read with a coffee page scroll of tips um how to use the art supplies that are in the box we always have these look at this swatching going on down here yes <laughs> i can tell you it's gonna have a messy swatching time later um scroll the tips behind the artwork so that's behind the artwork of the piece that we received in the box oh scroll the gallery let's see if i can see any names that i know oh me <laughs> Oh my god, I made it in. <laughs> there I am. I made it into the scrawler magazine. Oh, I'm so excited. There's Annie. Yes. I'm right next to Annie. This is so cool. Scrawler buds. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we made it in. Oh, I'm so happy. We can see if there's anybody else that I know. Do, do, do. I've got nobody else jumping out to me and Annie. Yes. There we are. Um, <clears throat> this is from a couple of boxes ago. This is not the last box, clearly, because I haven't done that one yet. I don't know how I've got so behind. Um, then we've got Scrawler Top 3. So we've got Tortville uh, Zinkovicute. <laughs> sorry, I am sorry. I've just butchered that completely. <laughs> Uh, beautiful cat there. We've got Kelly McCracken, and I am loving this bear. That is so beautiful. And then Carrie's Clark with this fabulous flamingo. So cool. Look at these. Look at all these. Uh, there's the QR code. See the supplies in action. So you can click on that and do that. And then we've got the Scrawler community, which is always nice to go on there and have a little chat about with other people who've also got a box and get tips and tricks and all that kind of thing. Scrawler Extra, Unconscious Creativity. 
so all about dreams oh interesting and nightmares yeah <laughs> oh so scrawler box scrawler challenge this month is dream catcher oh that's bringing up some ideas for me so wakey wakey scrawlers it may have been a dream but don't let it slip away it's said that dreams are our subconscious imaginings of our memories and images so why not let this inspire you and put pastel to paper oh you wouldn't want some some of my dreams on paper you wouldn't want to see i promise you they're very weird very weird indeed <laughs> okay but that's the challenge for this month so there we go these are all the beautiful things that we have in our scroller zine this month i'll just lay them out nicely especially the sweetie treaty so that's it look at those we're gonna have fun with them well i'm gonna have fun with them for sure <laughs> hope you enjoyed this look through the box i will be back with something that i've created from this and the previous box i might combine them into two i don't know i might do two different videos who knows who knows what's going to happen in the mad world here at kooky towers anyway um speak to you very very soon have a great day bye for now mm -hmm.